Today is a very exciting time. Our Sumitil is making huge investments in terms of resources, time, and in management attention to remain at the forefront of digitalization in the steel industry. The digitalization should create value, both for a customer as also for our own company. I think ArcelorMittal is the right company for digitalization. I think people are going to be surprised for what is coming. I cannot predict the future, but what I know is that ArcelorMittal is really on the right track. Transforming tomorrow for ArcelorMittal is very important and, and digitalization will be a fantastic enabler. This new technology is really accelerating the change. So we are working on a lot of ideas. We have the data and the analytics, we have the new man-machine interface where the smartphone and the iPad are certainly one element in it. And then we have then the robotics and 3D printers, for instance. Our vision is, is very clear. It's a fully digitalized enterprise where everything is connected. We are really creating things that did not exist before. It's disruptive, changing the way we're doing business with the customer, but it's also changing the way we are producing our products. I call this company a digital transformation enabler. For me, it means a company that can innovate and be technical at the same time. In the past, it was all about uh, the big eat the small. Uh, in today's world, it's all about the fast eating the slow. The cost of information capture and storage, as well as the cost of computing, have decreased a lot. That allows a very fast development of constant new technologies. Advantage for a customer is that we can really say that we are having state-of-the-art IT commercial systems, which allow him to follow the life cycle of an order. From order entry, over the production steps in our mills, down to the, the shipments until the coils uh, are delivered uh, on his uh, premises. They're going to be able to uh, personalize products, but most of all, they're going to know that there is always a salesperson behind the screen. We can do lots of things with digitalization in the manufacturing sphere. There's a lot we can do in terms of what we call mixed reality. Mixed reality is when you're looking at, at, at real life and you're doing maintenance work, you look through it in a lens which enables you to better fix that equipment. One of the biggest developments in the last year were the driverless cranes. We started uh, to build automated stocks where we could identify a coil knew where it was lying. But for a driverless crane, you need to tell the crane that the crane automatically knows what it has to do, that it optimizes its work, and eventually condition monitor itself. The crane is completely autonomous. Today, if you go to our facilities around the world, you will see small clusters of people working together in finding solutions, almost like a startup style. To imagine a steel company addressing these challenges in a startup style, I think it's quite exciting. And most people who join the steel business will not expect that they have such opportunities in our room. The mindset is build it and then try it out, constantly adjusting the ideas along the way. Digitalization is to answer business needs in a faster manner. Digitalization to oszczędnić czasu, wymiana informacji, więcej czasu na relacje. You can't run these advanced and complex models in, in a normal environment, so, so we need to do it in Cerebro. So Cerebro is a cluster of servers with distributed computer power, well proven for high performance algorithms. We also have some programs to connect to our new supply chain, so give uh, order information to customers in real time. Nie wyobrażam sobie współpracy na tym poziomie bez steel usera, bez wymiany e, informacji, dokumentów. Nie widzę innego kierunku. To jest przyszłość. I think as we embark on further investing in these new capabilities, we will be better able to co-engineer with the customer their critical steel requirement. We make thousands of products. We have tremendous R&D capability. We develop 20% new products every year. Not every customer is aware of our capability. And using technology will enable that interaction to get richer and therefore uh, help both parties.